first place. If he was just like, I'm just going to say random words and it's going to work because he he is a wizard. OK, I don't know how he got this far as a wizard without having like some type of something to to deal with this without being like, oh, uh, I'm just going to leave. Well, he's clearly winging it. Yeah, it's just it's bad. Yeah, why would you start with that lesson if you didn't have anything to show the kids? Yeah, if you didn't have you, a plan. You showed up there with the cage full of pixies, and then you opened it. What were you going to do? Like, this was obviously worst case scenario. What was your best case scenario? What was your plan? How was this going to end well? Your random words were going to work? Why? Why? You know how magic works. You can't just you can't just mash words together and have a spell made. It just... <sighs> Although... Uh, a quick glance at Google, and the spell that he should have used is Pesky Pixie Pesternomi. He attempted to say that. Okay, so he did use the right spell. He yes. just doesn't have the skill level, maybe, to like execute it. Maybe he didn't wave his wand yeah. in the right way or something. That right. is supposedly the incantation of a charm meant to capture pixies. Okay, okay, okay. So he did have a plan. He knew the right spell, but maybe he didn't have the right hand motion or something. He, he just... fucked it up or it just plain didn't work for him because he doesn't know what he's doing. The uh... delivery sucked and... Fail. Yep. He failed. <laughs> Fail. Well, we know from Hermione that the way you pronounce certain spells matters. Yeah. And this is this is where, after after he left, this is where Ron is like, can you believe this shit? And Myony's like, he just wanted to give us some hands-on experience, guys. This is, you know, just us three, though, not the rest of the class. And Harry's like, dude, he had no fucking idea what he was doing. Yeah, they totally call him out. And Hermione freezes two of them with a little freeze charm, no problem. And she's 12. This, this is what I'm saying. He's a full-grown wizard. He should have had some backup plan, but he didn't. Why does the freeze charm only work on just two? Why doesn't it go for, like, the whole area? I think, number one, she's 12, so she probably doesn't have a whole bunch of power. And I think, also, they were spread out, so I think she probably pointed at two, like, in front of her and froze them. And it was just, like, one at a time type thing. How many pixies are we talking about that were let loose? Does it ever give a good accounting or no? Not in the book. My not... Super logical theory was going to be like maybe a couple dozen. Yeah. Way more than one, though. Yeah. Well, for sure. sure. (laughs) Well, we know that there was two that went out the window, two that had Neville, and then the rest. So there was at least, I don't know, at least eight. Probably more than that, though. But then um, Hermione, Hermione, Hermione responds to Harry saying that he had no idea what he was doing. And she's like, oh, no, that's rubbish. You you look at his books. You you know all the things he's done, and that's when Ron's like, he says he's done all that shit. Because Ron is not an idiot, despite what you may have learned from the movies. Ron's pretty fucking clever. Yes, everything that Lockhart has done so far is just shadowed for everybody that he's been around. Oh yeah, yeah. He just really likes to talk and make himself look good. We're not seeing any action out of him. No, he doesn't actually do anything ever. He's going to need to step up his game a little bit. Kind of the same as last year's Defense Against the Dark Arts teacher. Mm. He's supposedly really good at his job, too, and he never did it. But he wore a cool hat. Badass hat. Got to give the man that. Had good taste in hats. Turban. Nice headgear. (laughs) But that's where our chapter ends. So... We will have to see what Gildy has to bring to the table in the next episode. I don't like him. Oh, I don't think you're alone. No. And, and okay, I didn't say this earlier because it's just a side note, but his favorite color is lilac. That's purple. I don't like purple. I don't like purple at all. I think it's a terrible color. <laughs> well, baby, I know. <laughs> I like blue. Blue is much better. So his favorite color is purple. I don't like him. <laughs> Bad vibes. That's purely childish reason to not like a guy, but uh fuck you and your favorite color. Do you know why purple is a noble color? It was the most expensive thing to dye your robes with. Yep. Dye to get 
they it comes from sea slugs. Really? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Fun fact of the day, guys. <laughs> <laughs> I had no idea. That's why only royalty usually had purple robes or hats or cloaks. And that's why Nate hates purple. He's shaking off the monarchy. I ain't all about that fancy stuff. <laughs> Blue collar, baby. <laughs> Blue all the way. <laughs> <laughs> so I think that's where we're going to leave it for the night. We really want to hear back from some of you guys. We need some feedback. We're getting a whole bunch on the Facebook, but so far, not a whole lot from the Harry Potter fans. So let us know that you're out there. We know you're out there. We watch you listen. You can't hide from us. If you want to shoot us an email, you can do that. You can find us at podcastatt at gmail.com or on Facebook at all the things or at podcastatt. Also, that works for Instagram, at Podcast ATT. There's lots of fun things on there. you want to check it out. You can find us on Twitter, at Podcast underscore ATT. You're going to be underwhelmed, though. I'm not going to lie about the, the Twitter. It's it's kind of barren, but that's fine. You can, you can make it exciting. It's almost a running joke at this point. Yeah. It's okay. We like the twats. Nope. <laughs> Can't say that. <laughs> Let me try that again. That's okay. We like the twits. Tweets. 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 <laughs> I was going to use a different form of it, and I accidentally <laughs> said a word. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Twats. Totally a thing. <laughs> and if you're interested in hearing more of these funny little things that we say on the podcast, you can find us at Patreon at podcast. ATT as well. We have tons of gag reels up there, some deep cuts, some real interesting behind the scenes conversations. And I promise you're not going to be disappointed if you become a patron of ours. But yeah, we'll catch you back here next week. We love you. Thanks for listening. Yeah, we'll see you real soon. Mm-hmm.